All right, we are getting ready to load into Martinsville with the next gen. Um, unfortunately, it updated my paint scheme, so I've got to correct that real quick because apparently I did not put it on trading paints. So doing that real quick and getting rid of the blue and yellow, which is clearly bringing me bad luck. But we're at Martinsville, and luck doesn't matter. We're going to get wrecked. Just how it is. Uh, the next-gen car, very weird here. It's, uh... I, I don't know. You don't... And maybe I've just been doing this wrong in every single car that I've driven here. But you don't break into the corner kind of doing like GT style where get your braking done off the brakes turn left and it grips so yeah we'll see if uh, that will work for me in the race or if I'll just plow through someone most likely we'll plow through someone uh, just because Always, always very bad. So, you're downshifting. That helps me get it stopped. Because the brakes are not very good. And I have not got that figured out quite right. Definitely don't get up on the curb. But, this thing could just go to shit later in the run. Uh, sometimes I can spin out on corner exit if I try to hold it too low, so I've got to watch out for that. And then if I overdrive the corner, then we have some issues as well, so can't do any of that and hopefully qualify up front and not have to deal with anyone. Uh, from the looks of practice, it looked like we were going to be kind of ahead of the rest of the field and then behind the setup shop douchebags. So we'll see how it goes. Hopefully we can just fall into that gap and uh, get a good 135 laps. But yeah, I'm sure. Well, the game froze. Didn't it? It's not switching over to the race server. Uh, let's just hop out and load back in. Maybe the whole server crashed. Because it said, nope, this car is stupid. We don't want you running it. Awesome. All right, well, like I said last time, we had this crash on us. Hopefully that gets our crash out of the way and we'll be fine in the race. Yeah, I'm not sure. I think something broke. It's definitely not acting normal. Okay, well, bear with me for a second. Might be starting in the back. Double check the forums just to see if anyone else is in there. Don't see anything, any complaints happening. We got the join button again. Let's give this another go. <sighs> okay, so I just closed the UI, opened it back up. We had the join button. I know a lot of people get confused when it says you're already in the server. Don't withdraw. Just shut the UI down, shut the website down, open it back up. It should be fixed and allow you back in. Don't ever, if you go into the uh, task menu and um, 
shut things down through there, then you could have a lot of issues. Although I just got Sim is running, so maybe we got more issues. I would like to race, amazingly, even if it's Martinsville. But appreciate being able to join. Maybe the servers just died. Joining session. Let's give this another try. Did that work? Did not. Sweet. Again. Uh well, we're we're just having some bad luck now. Don't think we're gonna get a qualifying lap in, so I hope everyone else was kicked out of there. I actually practiced learned a little bit about the setup. Uh, we're going to be multiple laps down if we do get in. iRacing is already running. Okay, well, now I've got to do the thing that I told you not to do because it's completely broke. And I'm not going to try to explain how to get this to work. If you're decent with computers, then there's a simple, easy iRacing start service. And uh, we'll try that. See, every once in a while, everything just goes to shit. Could not initialize. Awesome. It's going well. Start iRacing service. Welcome to iRacing. Join. Are we actually going to join the server? We are. Look at that. Probably just in time to see qualifying is already over. Yeah, so I won't explain all of that, but there's a start and stop service in the iRacing folder. Um, if you don't know what to look for, don't go trying to get into that. But if you do, that is one way to deal with it if you get the already running message, which I haven't got in a long time. Sim loading 15%. I, I think it's just it's fucking broken. I don't think it's on my end. Let's look at iRacing status. Everything says it's okay. There we go. It's loading some more. We may be starting at the very back if we accidentally load in in between qualifying and the race starting. Hopefully they're not racing. Miss start. Well... Fuck me. You have three additional sets of tires during this race. Have a good race. <laughs> Luckily, you know, we're in the 22nd pit stall. Um, 
Got 135 laps to make up some spots. We'll be most likely a lap down, unless there's an early wreck. So there we go. And that is how we end up in a bad position for this one. Looks like they just pulled away, so we just missed it. Because so they're now starting their second pace lap. Oh well, most likely going to be a caution early. I'm not going to come out in the middle of the pack if we can't get to the end of pit road. So we'll just put around, get the lucky dog. And, uh, hope that there's an early Light caution. Car is on. Be ready. How long is it going to hold me for here? Green flag, green flag. 11 seconds. We're going to be a lap down before we even get to pit road exit. Come on, boys, wreck them up. No speeding penalty. All right, well, this is unfortunate. We'll come out right here, because it looks like there's a gap. And there we go, one lap down. And I've just completely missed the corner because I'm not in race mode at all. Should be able to hold this spot fairly simple. smoke from people blocking it. I don't want to try to pass this guy, but I kind of need to. Because if we go for too long, the back half of the field is going to start getting wrapped. And amazingly, we're still under green, so... The car outside one time I need a early caution to save my race. Loose on corner entry. Got the downshift a bit too early. Off the brakes. I gotta remember to lift off the brakes. Otherwise it just does not turn. Yeah, you lock him up like you see everyone else doing. It's so hard to lift off it though when the car doesn't feel like it's stopping, but it will turn if you lift off. But we're going long enough that there's going to be other people a lap down, and that absolutely sucks. No one's going to just pull over for a lap car. Oh, we're going to kill this guy. Maybe not. Thought we were going to. Might kill this guy or get killed. Jesus. Outside, 
All right, well, we're passing people for position now. I don't know why they're going to the inside of the straightaway to let people by. It's a little odd, but whatever. So right now we're not Lucky Dog. It's going to take a few yellows for us to get back on the lead lap. And we're going to have to hope that people pit for tires and we get a wave around, or I don't know how we do this, but. Oh, I was hoping you'd hit him, but then I don't think I was going to miss him. Well, we look quick. Does that count for anything? Can't have that loose. There we go, we got a caution. But we're not the lucky dog. Yellow flag is out. Line up, single file. Closed, pit road is closed. Pass the pace car. Catch up, three. Car. We just have to hope the leaders pit, which I don't think they will. And there is a shit ton of people to lap down, all the way to 10th place. So. We're gonna have a lot of people to pass as well if the leaders don't pit here. How many tires do we got? 13. Got the lucky dog. Let them pass on the outside. One of the leaders went. We look quick though. We might be fifth or sixth fastest. Uh, it's gonna be difficult to recover though. But if we can get top 10, then cool. I'm not even gonna pit. I know we're not gonna get the wave around. But. I need to gain some spots on the people that are also a lap down. So we'll be getting sent to the back. But it's much better for us to be ahead of a few people and maybe get some spots. So we've got four people in front of us until we get the lucky dog. make it the whole way on fuel, so I'm not worried about that. And tire wear really hasn't been too much of an issue, so... Not too worried about that as well. Letter 21, carbide. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. Letter 3, carbide. Letter 7, carbide. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. Well, this definitely made it a lot more interesting than I wanted it to be. One left to green. Line up on the inside. point one eight seven. Hang on, we're not going green, not going green. Hang on, we're not going green, not going green. Alright, so the 
car we need to pass is the 17. 17, 14, 10, and 16 are ahead of us. One to go, next time by. 42.9. Second gear start. The first gear is way too quick. Get ready, going green. Post car is off, time to do your job. Green flag, green flag. Might get a black flag. Had to take the risk. That was so close to being disaster for us and getting a black flag. So we need to get around the 14 now. Fuck me. Alright, well... We're next in line. Pass the pipe car. Didn't have enough time. I was hoping he'd screw that up. I was taking it really easy under him. But, uh, we're in position for the next one, I hope. Why couldn't we had that quick of a caution at the start? Car 14, got the lucky dog, let them pass on the outside. Oh, so damn close. Pit roads open. We were, in real life that would have been illegal since we changed lanes before the uh, start finish line, but we didn't pass before the start finish line to the left. It's damn near there. Had he drugged the brakes a little bit, I think we would have got a penalty and the race would have been really over. But that got me to this spot and now I can kind of just chill because definitely don't think any of the cars behind us one lap down are a threat. So... We just gotta not get ran into and get a caution. We're gonna take fuel every time I pit just because I don't want another Iowa situation where it just all of a sudden gets stupid loose for no reason. Left us, 11, carbide. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. Left us, 8, carbide. Catch us, 8, car. So we got a couple of people back there. Left us, 6, carbide. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. Left us, 2, carbide. Left us, 13, carbide. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. All right, is that it? One left to green. Line up on the inside. Catch up, two, yes. car. All right. So, everyone in front of us Point three, doesn't matter. Seven, three. We just need to avoid getting passed by anyone behind us and 
not getting in a wreck. Get ready, going green. Post car is off, time to do your job. can't get an incident, so shit happens ahead of us, we need to avoid it and not get ran over. But there's no reason for me to try to pass any of these guys. There's a couple of them though that I probably need to, like the 21. And the 15 is having some issues, so we can get past him. Still there. 19.667. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Outside, clear. Okay, caution. You can come out anytime you'd like now. 19.3. Like there. Go low. Flag. Beautiful. We gotta be lucky, dog, right? Alright, we are. So now we start at the back of the pack. We'll go in, get tires now, because. We're uh, going to be at the back anyways. Letter 13, Carbide, you had the position when the yellow flag came out. You are the lucky dog. Get your lap back by passing the field on the outside. Pass the pace car, catch up, six car. Well, it's been an interesting one. And, well, looks like the 19 is blown up, but we can't pass him, so. Oh my god, people. Quick stop. Should be fine getting out. Okay, punch it. No speeding. Back in the race to try to get a top five. But we got to start in the back, so now we just got to avoid people. Because you're the lucky dog, you'll be held at the end of the longest line. Let us twenty carbide. People that are going to be coming out of the pits. So we're going to let by. One to go. Next time by, you'll be lining up Maybe on not. the inside. Six cars now a lap down after that wreck. All right, are they just lining them all up on the inside behind us? Apparently so. Get ready. Going green. Post car is off. 20 cars is going to start 5 miles back, but that's fine, we have no 
you need. Green flag, green flag. And the 20 cars. Having fucking issues everywhere, Jesus. Outside is clear. 28.058. Car outside. So low. Outside, clear. Let's try to survive this fun. A lot of people are not getting to let off the brakes. Took me a while to figure out. It was kind of an accident, but once I did, I was like, oh, okay, well, that's going to make it easier. The whole front of the field died. Alright, well, might get some spots now, and then hopefully we can just survive. Kind of amazed at the start, getting lots of laps in, and then, uh, rides open. yeah, now it's turned into Martinsville. Catch up, 14 car. Any of the leaders went in. Yeah, we got two that went in. Car 10, got the lucky dog, let them pass on the outside. Yeah, so now we're probably going to be pacing for a while until a lot of these people wreck themselves out. But I think we're still going to have some of these people trying to hang in at the back that are struggling to even drive straight under pace laps. But we got a shot at the top six now, so just got to hope we don't get wrecked. that came off of it were 99 100 there's like absolutely no tire wear so I think it's just gonna be a heating issue We're in seventh place now. Gives us the inside, and uh, just gotta not get into any incidents. A lot of these people are already beat up pretty bad. It's gonna be easy to do when pushing more brake makes it go straight, so. We're in a good position here, though. Pretty much only lap cars behind us, except for the people that keep hitting. Just need to find a nice spot to fall in, get past the 14, 15, and 21. And, uh, log some laps.
But yeah, anytime you see that puff of smoke from someone, they're just on the brakes too long. Get all the braking done before you get to the concrete. And then let it roll and it will turn. Watch out for the 15 getting into the back of the 21. 19.275 We're faster than the three guys ahead of us, but nothing we can do at the moment. Caution. Well, we're in the top five. It only took us 53 laps. Helps that this field is absolutely terrible on speed. Pit road's open. <sighs> Please pit 15. Nope. Alright, that's fine. We're gonna start. Inside. Six gets the lucky dog. So. Or not the. Yeah, the six car. Got the lucky dog. Let them pass on the outside. He was looking kind of quick to us, but then kind of started to fade. On that first run. Kind of hard to tell if he was as quick as us, but he's got damage. We've got how many people on the lead lap? Eleven of us now. And sixteen people that are one lap down. And then it goes to seven laps down, eight, ten, and lots of people out from the start, so. I don't even know if we pit again. I don't think tires are helpful. I feel better on lap 10 of a run, so. But that could just be because I'm slow. I think we're quicker than the seven. I was just trying not to run into the back of the 15 and the 21. So we could find ourselves in third. Speed road is closed. This one is taking much longer than I wanted it to now. It surprised me on the first run, but... Oh, this is all looking like Martinsville now. One left to green. Line up on the inside. 43.601. So 10 cars right behind us. Get ready, going green. Post car is off, time to do your job. 15's been pretty bad on starts and entering the next corner, so we should clear him. That guy just blew the corner and is in the wall and is wrecking the field and we're in third <laughs> I knew I needed to stay really low there because I figured the dude had an absolute shit ton of wheel cranked in that thing and he did he 
He very much did. Sorry, I kind of screwed everyone over there. Alright, well, there we go. Third place now. And everyone behind us got some damage. Who the hell knows who's going to get the lucky dog out of that one? Got the lucky dog. Let them pass on the outside. Leather 24 carbine. Yeah, that was an interesting one. Dude dove it in there, kept brake on it, because it's it is so hard to just lift off the brake. Especially when you overshot the corner. Because you think that's gonna make it worse. And pushed up, then got in the wall, and still couldn't get its turn, and then all of a sudden it turned. I don't know if he looped it off the corner or just got hit by the 15. But now we're ahead of where we're supposed to be, and I think the number three and number four are out of the race already, so now we just hang out and hope that we get some laps. Find out if we do have any pace. Closed. Pit road is closed. So, now we've got 15 cars that are a lap down or on the lead lap. And 11 cars on the lead lap. It's kind of just been stuck there as everyone continues to get damage and wreck from the lead lap. With this setup, I, I just did a bunch of shit that I have no idea if it's actually doing anything. Lowered the front and rear bars. Um, just, like did everything I could to make it want to turn. And it might hurt us later on, but I found the left rear shock really helped balance in the corner and off the corner, so... I'm not even going to try to pass the two, because he is a just complete idiot. No need to go fight with him, and they're wrecking again. They want you in single file. Closed. Pit road is closed. Catch up to car. We just made it up to this position in the best, best Catch time. Two, car. And we keep getting inside starts, Pit road is now which open. is helping us. One blinking behind us. Yeah, so um, this is boring. I and mean, eventually, these guys have got to all wreck out, and it'll just be us three left, and I can finish third. Car Twenty-three got the lucky dog. Let them pass on the outside. Letter 23 carbine. Some of these people that are two and eight laps down might get their laps back on and get onto the lead lap. But, uh, yeah. We're up to 12 on the lead lap now. That is an all time record for like the last 40 laps.
yeah, so this is the preview of what's coming on NIS. I figured I'd try this because this is we we have nothing like this in racing with the shifting and the Close. independent Brody suspension Close. and it's it feels like you would think it does it doesn't feel like a stock car off the corner still it's kind of either all on the right rear or just no feeling at all so we just got Got to get used to this, I guess. I don't know how much I'm going to race this next season. Um, I mainly do it right now because it gets really good views. And it's really easy. Coming up on halfway because here. there's no one, one that's green. fast that runs Line this, so I can get top fives. Or if you go in a B or C or A car, you've got people that show up and are past pro drivers and have some talent, but right now the series is extremely easy. Probably easier focus. fields okay, than the NASCAR Legends, so it makes it easy to uh, just hop in, make some content, and uh, laugh at how sad NASCAR is now. So now I just gotta not spin out on entry or corner exit. This guy behind. Scaring the hell out of me with how deep he's going into the corner. I mean, he's getting it to turn, but he's terrible off the corner. Just hoping that we're not going to be helping him get around the corner soon. He might be faster than us. And he's on older tires by a lap. Locked up the tires. Bad exit. Get off the brakes. This guy's gonna eventually overheat his right front or spin it on exit, I think. God. Yep, there it is. I was waiting for him to do that. With as hard as he's going in, he's got to be cranking a ton of wheel. Figured that was coming. At least we're getting some laps clicked off. 21 just missed the turn. Yeah, so setup's not that fast, but we're at least uh, faster than the people that we need to be. And I don't think any of the other fast cars that got damaged are going to be able to make it back. Well, especially not the three, because he's getting lapped again. But as more and more people go a lap down, that's going to make sure that the four doesn't get his lap back, and he's got two laps to get back, so... It's going to be that much more harder, more difficult for him. Three cars, don't get 
outside. And Caution. Yellow flag. Curse up down low. Had to just make sure that we were going to be able to see him. Open. Okay, well. Definitely not giving up track position. <laughs> not with the way this shit shows me. Got the lucky dog, let them pass on the outside. They are. Uh, a lot of people are going to get a wave around here. Had I pit, that would have allowed the four to get a wave around, and he would get a lap back, and that would put him one step closer. Oh, never mind. He's five laps down now. Don't have to worry about that. These guys aren't going to take a wave around. Interesting. I mean, really, my pace is not too much different than my fast laps, so screw it. Take track position. Got the 7 car, the 8 and the 6, and the 14 all stayed out, so now the 1 and the 2 are back in 7th and 8th, or 6th and 7th. Some of these guys are going to get their laps back. I mean, we're racing the people behind us. And not the one and the two. Those guys are not in the same category as the rest of the field. So, our goal is to not die. I think we can still get a decent finish with not pitting again. One to go. Next time by, you'll be lining up on the inside. 44.292. Get ready. But let's green. just hope that we don't get clobbered into off. one. Got clobbered. Still there. Outside is clear. Nineteen point nine seven. The side corner. Seven is getting spun by the one. Outside. No caution. Clear up top. Cast off the head. 19 .3 Seven is still stopped on track, apparently. Oh, he's going again. And now we go. A caution. And that is why I didn't want to be back. I mean, I'm just going to pull over for the one and the two. If the six goes to the inside, I'm going to pull over for him as well. But, I mean, at this point, the eight, the 14, the 21, I think we still got him beat on old tires, so. 
all I care about is not getting killed. But since the one car just killed the seven, not too confident about this next start. Car 24, got the lucky dog, let them pass on the outside. All right, that is gonna put 12 cars on the lead lap. Unless the seven went a lap down there. Let the 24 car by. 45 to go. Or, yeah, 45 to go, right? I can do math. Yep. Still at zero incident, and uh, yeah, everyone else is looking pretty rough. We've got 15 people now, one lap or less down, three people are one lap down, and 12 on the lead lap. And I'm guessing we're going to get all of those guys back on the lead lap. So 16's looking much better on corner entry, but I'm also taking it very easy and forgetting to lift off the brakes. Line up on the inside, 44.168. But I gotta watch out for the two and the one. Just fall in behind them without getting wrecked, but they're gonna have to instantly pass Get since going they got to sell that set Post car is off time to do your job Not going to be able to sell that set very well when you've pissed off the entire field. Catch the pace car. Catch the three car. Catch the four car. Catch the 17 car. like a bunch of people got trapped behind the pace car because of the early wreck before everyone got past the start finish line but they'll get a wave around six cars back up front so maybe there was two different wrecks or maybe he's uh, gonna take out the one seven's gonna go a lap down here Yeah, so, absolute Martinsville. Letter 20, Carbide, you had the position when the yellow flag came out. Three cars. 
Let's head to the pits. And we've got... 12 cars on the lead lap. As the seven's now a lap down, so... It's staying the same. Could have got those three guys back on, but... Seven got involved in that, and... Uh, he's gonna lose a lap and maybe two laps. I don't know if he's going or not. But yeah, we're gonna completely get wrecked by the one because he hasn't fucking got around anyone without hitting him. One of those people that only knows how to be out front and has no idea how to be patient. One left to green. Line up on the inside. 43.897. Catch the 17 car. Catch the pace car. And it kind of sucks for the six because he was definitely going to beat us. He's got some issues now, so. Get ready. Going green. Pace car is off. Hang on, we're not going green, not going green. Hang on, we're not going green, not going green. Catch the pace car. let someone by. One to go, next time by. 42.254. Who the hell knows how this is going to go? Pace car's on the pit road. He should be coming back out. Catch the pace car. Yep. Get ready, going green. Post car is off, time to do your job. Alright, do we die? Green flag, green flag. Not if I switch up my start and get a bit more space. One, seven, seven. We have a new leader. Just gonna let him go low, cause it is not worth getting wrecked. And the one's probably going to end up wrecking him, so. A car's got a bit of speed on corner entry. I have to try to get through the corner a little quicker, quicker. Yeah, I was just waiting a long time to let off in the last few laps, so we're fine on tires. The next car's the leader. We'll see if the uh, six or seven gives the one a little payback as he laps them. And a caution. Single file. Closed. Pit road is closed. Catch up two car. But again, no reason for us to pit. Running pretty much the same laps that I was on fresh tires. Pit road is now open. Left us 15 carbide. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. Catch up two car. Left us 15 carbide. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. So looking like a third, but again, we could easily get drilled into the corner at any of these points. The 10 cars back up here. 
but I kind of got back into my faster rhythm, so we should be able to pull away from the guys behind us if we survive. Six cars, two laps down now, and this is our 11th car coming on to the lead lap. That leaves us only one car, one lap down, the six car, two laps down, and that's it. But yeah, definitely uh, track position over fresh tires, because my speed hasn't changed. I'm guessing these tires are not even going to be under 95%. So definitely something broken on short track tires because locking them up as hard as we're going through the corners, um, there should be a lot more wear. You know, I understand the no wear or very little wear at 1.5s because you're not sliding the car at all. There's a lot of sliding happening here. But, we're on the inside. And, uh, we didn't get wrecked amazingly. We gotta survive 24 more laps. And then we're going to do 250 laps on Friday for NIS. And then we're going to do a full 500 race, although, what is it, like 312 laps or something at Phoenix? Um, so. One lap to green. Line up on the inside. 43. Going to end nine, the two, season with seven. a bunch of cautions. But that'll happen when you get Martinsville. Just got to get a good start here. Don't let the eight have a chance. One car was going early when he was the leader earlier. Green flag, green flag. The next car's the leader. Not to worry about the two. I just needed to get a good start to get some distance. Miss shift. Luckily, the eight's damaged because it looks like he is would be quicker than us if he didn't have damage. I don't remember where he was on that first run if we were ahead of him or behind him when we were trying to get our lap back. Who knows how much damage is actually affecting, but. Uh, if I drive up on the curb like that too much, then he's going to be back on top of us. So yeah, using the engine braking to slow the car as well. off the brakes and turn it. Didn't get off the brakes early enough, but 
we're still uh, looking at maybe doing a personal best. No, it looks like we got through three and four really good on our personal best. And I don't need to try to go personal best because I'll just spin it out of the corner if I'm pushing too hard. Fourteen to go. I can actually drive here so much better in this car. Maybe the lifting off the brakes is going to help me in the cup car. In the current cup car. But, uh, yeah. Really was hoping we could just finish that one off. Might get a few people behind us pitting, but again, it's not going to make a difference. Two's going to pit for no reason. That's going to put us on the outside. That could be our downfall. Car 18, got the lucky dog, let them pass on the outside. Just got to get a good start without running into the wall. And uh, maybe take home a second then. Yeah, because there is 10 people on the lead lap. Uh, that was a very dumb decision. Second fastest car in the race, and he's going to finish, like, seventh. Maybe third. Depends on how many people he plows through, how much he wants to be like the one. You had the position when the yellow flag came out. Closed. Pit road is closed. Ten to go. This time by. Oh, I just got to get a good start, but it's going to be difficult. One to go, next time by, 43.793, line up on the outside. Alright, all I want is a second place, or a third if the two gets back up here. Get don't ready. even Going care about rain. the lead, just don't want to get the ran into. Fuck, it's so hard to turn up there. Luckily, he was pretty terrible on the inside. And they're wrecking. Stay green. Twenty-one's in third right now. Let's get to the end. Point zero two nine. 
Just gotta lift off. Remind myself every corner to lift off. Let's get it to the end, boys. White flag. Can ease it around. Won't be a caution. So we will have to watch out for anyone sitting around. But uh, for how that one started out, zero incidents in P2. Third fastest car on track. I will take that. And, uh... Alright, well, this is going to take five fucking hours, but let's uh, go through all the wrecks. Six car gets into the 20, and the 20, and the 19, and the 8, and they all wreck, and that wasn't even a caution. Man, some of these people. It's just, just, lift off the brakes. 13's losing it. 24 freaks out. No caution for that. Six almost got me there, or it did get me there, and I got into the 21. Then the 21 went low to let us by. 12 way up top. 16. And six self spins, but kind of had it saved, but had to stop it to save it. And that's where he goes around. And then it just all goes bad. Fuck. Uh, 18 car. I don't think I talk shit about you. See what the car the car looks like. Oh no, I don't think I did. And the eight turns to sixteen. 
You know, a lot of those people that got wrecked later in the race, I know it wasn't by the people that they hit, but kind of looking like karma. Oh, and he's high centered trying to get off the curb. And the four hits him. Did the four know he was there? Oh, he finally broke loose. Nope. The four just hit him. And that is why the four ended up multiple laps down. There's a whole lot of stuff we missed out there. And the two takes out the six. The 19 blows up. Three misses the corner, as well as the seven. James trying to get the car turned. It did not turn. And the eight self spins. And destroys the three cars race. Oh, and the 11 and 13, they both sort of made it through, and then did not. 17's gonna miss that corner. And miss that one as well. Nope. Nope. Maybe. Twenty one's gonna self-spin, though. And then this is where the seven overdrives the corner, hits the wall, and then somehow spins down and look at this fucking pile up. I mean this was an impressive pile up. I guess only four cars. Just a few more angles of it. Fifteen is gonna dive in. Nope, the fourteen gets the eight. And then the four gets some contact. And the six. Don't know what that was. That was weird. Fifteen when he was working on us and lost it though. 16, messing the corner. 23, curb. Very lucky he didn't spin out there. 24, not very lucky. Oh, seven self spun. He didn't even get hit. Maybe he got hit on corner entry. No, he just self-spun. Alright. I thought the one had got him. Looked like the situation that he did. 15's not going to make that corner. <laughs> Everyone trying to figure out that he can't go until the leader goes. And... Well, that wasn't on me. That was... The three hanging back, trying to get a run. I don't know how he was going. Oh, okay. Someone up there is hanging back. They think we're all going. Race hasn't started, and now it has. They all accordioned. And the six gets turned. That time, the one got him. I mean, he did leave the bottom completely open, but I you're the fastest car out there, and you don't need to do the pass instantly. So then the 6 tries to get going, and contact between him and the 14, and everyone stacks up, and the 3 gets another wreck. How some of these people were still going on incidents, I have no idea. So 
16 is going to miss the corner and blink out. 15 is going to self spin off the corner again. Loop it, trying not to eat the wall. How do you get in? Okay, the 17 just runs into the 18. What'd you do to him? Well, I have no idea. Clearly, you did something to him. Oh, and the 10 just turns in, and I couldn't tell what the hell happened behind, but, um, yeah, the 10 just turned in. I don't know, that was weird. But, uh, they lost a bunch of spots, and it kind of delayed the 2. I thought it was actually going to help him, but with the 15 getting back by him there, kind of delayed his progress. We're spinning off the corner, and the 21 and the 15 getting into each other. Luckily, no caution. 10, half sort of spinning, and doesn't make it to the finish line. But there you have it. I think that one had everything in it, um, from the computer breaking to uh, laps down, only one pit stop. Oh yeah, real quick. Didn't even see. 99, 99, 99, 99. Yeah, probably didn't even need to pit, but we did. So let's uh, take a look at these results. We got 42 I rating and 29 safety rating there you go p2 it's just yeah this car is i don't even know what to say does not feel like a short track car stock car it just it doesn't work on anything so definitely they went way too conservative on tires because there's no way in hell i should have been 99 99s all the way around um, but there you go. That was something. Uh, yeah, definitely some work to do on the tire wear, but very, very weird car to drive here. So, uh, thanks for watching.